Okay, the first step is uh, we've got to get rid of some of this powder coat paint, so it's going to kind of scrape it off. It doesn't have to be 100%, but make room for the, uh, for the wheels to fit on there properly. That's probably all we need to do. Check it with a wheel, no problem. And we're going to put some grease on. Put the wheel on and we'll do the same thing to the other side. And we can do that with all four with all uh, four wheels. Then we take our, take our frames and they are faced away from each other in this manner. So what we'll do is we'll just put one of the uh, yep. Put the front axle in, and we'll start one of these uh, three-inch lock nuts. Make your tight. Won't go very far. Sideways here. Put this side on. Same idea. Okay. That's the first step. Now we're going to take the nose piece, set it there, should line up with uh, two 5 16 bolts and nuts on each side. Just finger tight, just kind of wiggle them in there. Okay, this is the K backstrap for 55 gallon drum going. This will just fasten with the same types as 516 bolts and nuts. Yep. Two on the top. We'll do this left handed. this around, get it started. There you go. Gotta jiggle it around a little. That's why you leave everything loose. Okay, now you take your other axle and get that started. Now this is the hard part. You just have to get it in there and, and kind of force it down. And then get your other nut started. So you tighten, then you can start tightening up all your bolts and try to go alternate from left and right to help keep things Keep things uh, straight. There's that, and then we'll go back and forth to the other axle. And the other axle. Half inch socket, and we'll start tightening the nose piece. Back and forth, alternate, left and right. And I would say, yeah, make sure all four wheels are even on the floor and tighten down the final four bolts of the back strip. Okay, to load the 40, I'm going to use the model 31. So 
So the first step is to get this nose piece underneath the bottom of the drum, and I'm gonna ask my friend to help tip the drum back so that I can get it underneath there. Okay, let her down. And we'll take that same 31, rest it in there. I'm gonna put my foot up here, because this is a pretty heavy drum, and just pull it over. That's all there is to it. 